it's Lisa again from uh, the Homeschool Path to Foreign Language and I just want to talk about a really common question um, that I get and it is what are reasonable expectations for um, how fast your child can learn a foreign language like you know how many years is this gonna take or can it happen in three months is that possible can we do this really quick okay well first of all there's this myth that little children can learn a language so easily and they'll just pick it up really fast and you know I found a lot of studies that contradict that and little children you know they're working really hard to learn a language it's not just this effortless kind of thing like they're working it doesn't look like work to you from the outside because nobody else looks like they're working on the outside right you feel like you're working when you're the one doing it but when you're watching somebody else it doesn't look that hard so I think that's what's going on with little kids as we watch them and we're like oh they're having fun they're working right and it takes a long time it takes years oh my gosh I look at my kids and I'm like gosh even my 10 year old still doesn't know English the way that I know English he doesn't know it like an adult even though he reads for hours every day it's 10 years into this and it's his first language and his native language and he's with me all day and I'm a lawyer it's not like I'm not using big words with him right you know it just takes a while to acquire a language um, I when my child was my oldest child was in um, he started Chinese school you know, first of all, I've said before, we didn't even think it would, we would make it a semester, right? I thought it'd be too hard. It's not. Um, and then we were like a year into it and I was like, oh gosh, why isn't he saying anything? Because, you know, it's hard to be able to talk after a year. And then I thought about it and I was like, wait a minute, I took Spanish. I took four years of high school Spanish and almost a year of college Spanish and I still couldn't speak any Spanish. It was not reasonable for me to expect my child to start speaking Chinese after one year of Chinese, two hours a week, and supporting him at home. You know, that's not going to happen. So um, now we are, he's in his fifth year, and this is the year, you know, last year he was like willing to talk a little bit. Um, this is the year that he is finally able to say a little bit more. He'll talk um, willingly. And he actually says stuff in Chinese to me every day, uh, multiple times throughout the day. And I mean, I don't always understand it, but, you know, he likes to say it to me. And he and his sisters will play, like, store in Chinese together and stuff like that. Now, they're not, like, sitting there, you know knowing everything to say like they slip in and out between Chinese and English right because you know he's in his fifth year well that's about how I could speak Spanish after five years and I sure studied it a lot more hours than he did between high school and college um, so uh, I think you just have to look at it like learning anything else like learning um, math or music or art or anything you know you don't learn a complicated subject in three months and languages are really complicated you might not think about English as being complicated because you speak it but learning a foreign language it is really really complicated and it's gonna take years and years and years now, that's the bad news. The good news is it doesn't ever have to be painful or awful. I mean, just enjoy it, you know, go through it. Um, I hope that my book gives you ideas for how to enjoy it with your children and, and how to just, um, you know, do the kinds of things that will have them naturally acquire a foreign language through your environment that you build at your house and not just through sitting through lessons. Let me tell you, it's not about lessons. I mean, you got to have good lessons, but it's not just the lessons. You know, you got to have all the pieces together. So, and that, I mean, hopefully the book will help you in building that for yourself. Um, and also in kind of setting your expectations that, you know, <laughs> you can't just take a six week.
Spanish course at your library and have your kids speaking Spanish. It's a whole language, right? It's not going to work like that. Um, it's going to take a lot, a lot, a lot of years. And it's not necessarily going to take um, tedium or anything like that. So it's okay, but you have to mentally kind of prepare yourself, I think, for the long haul. And, um, but it's a good haul.